going on YouTube family and friends? This is going to be the first episode of Car Convos. I'm going to be coming to you talking about different shit that's been going on, whether it's in the news, in the media, whatever. So today I want to talk about um, Aisha Curry and all this crap that has been going on with her in the media. As you all know, she did a red table talk with Jada Pinkett and with um, her husband's sister and mom and all of that, which I didn't even know Steph Curry had a sister. And she's pretty, real, real, real pretty, look just like his light, bright ass. But she was talking about how she has been feeling insecure um, because d during the duration time of her being with her husband, you know, he, she's married to Steph Curry, you know, Steph Curry with the shot boy. But, um, He's got all these groupies that chase his ass left, chase his ass left and right, of course, because he's an athlete. So he gets pussy thrown in his face, gets smacked in the face with pussy all the dog on time. Although Steph don't seem like he the type of nigga that go for that. He seemed like he a good nigga. I don't know that, but that's what he seemed like. But um she was just saying how she feels insecure because she does not get all the attention and all the cat calls and shit that Steph gets and so it sometimes make her feel like she doesn't got it no more she don't got it no more or whatever and you know what at first I was like bitch get the fuck out of here you so goddamn pretty with your light bright ass shut up but then again I thought about it you know I've been married for 12 years. No, I take that back. I've been married for eight years. Been with my husband for 12 years. And so I can, I totally, totally, after I sat back and I thought about it, because I don't want to bash, because I was like, bitch, shut up. You know, you shut up. But I thought about it, because like I said, I've been with my husband for a minute. And of course, your husband makes you feel like, like you so goddamn fine. And that's good. That's what he's supposed to do. But it is good to get some whistles here and there from an outside source. I completely feel her on that. Not saying that you gon' you, you you jumping at it or you you know you you out you looking for something different. No 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 no. That's not what I'm saying. Why is this motherfucker driving so damn slow? I guess it's okay to drive the speed limit, boo boo. Auntie ways. But I, I feel her on that though. Not saying that she out looking for something, but you know what, Jada and, and other homegirls at the, that was at the table, they brought up a valid point. You're not out looking for nothing. So being that you're not out looking for nothing, ain't nothing just gonna be coming to you like that. You know what I'm saying? It'd be different if you out there and, and you looking for it. But if you ain't looking for it, then 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 fuck it. But I feel what she's saying though. But Aisha got a lot going on for her. Did y'all know? I know she started off on YouTube, and I know she made like a little cooking channel out of YouTube, but from there, I did not know that, well, I did know she had her own cooking channel, but I didn't know that she had a cookbook, and and I didn't know that she had her own little cosmetic line, I think it's with CoverGirl, and HomeGirl got her own kitchenware. I did not know that. So she got a got she got a goddamn lot going on for her, but I think it's just messed up that you know, a lot of people, a lot of black folks was going in on her. Like, it was so many goddamn memes about this girl and black folks. Oh, black folks, y'all are rude. We we some rude motherfuckers. Because I felt bad for Aisha. I really did feel bad for her because the girl was just expressing how she felt. You know what I'm saying? But... I don't know. I mean, I feel her. I completely feel her. You know, she she feel like she ain't getting all the attention and she, you know, she feels insecure because he's getting all these bitches pow pow throwing pussy in his face left and right. But damn, I'm gonna be honest as a woman, I don't want dick thrown at me all the time like that. Because if really honestly, she done opened up the floodgates. Now I'm sure her DM's finna be packed full of dick pics, all because she done put it out there that she wants a little bit of attention. See, when you throw shit out there like that, somebody go, somebody gonna catch that bitch. So she done threw that shit out there. So somebody gonna catch that shit. So I wouldn't be surprised if she got a lot of dick pics in her DMs. It's on the way. I bet you it is. But um, something else I wanted to talk about is um, Kim Kardashian freeing prisoners. Now. I ain't gonna lie. I don't like Kim Kardashian. I don't like Kim Kardashian at all. I don't like her. I think she's a bobblehead. I think she's an airhead. I, I don't like her. But I will say, since she has been doing this whole thing where she's 
all of a sudden into you know the the, the whole legal thing and 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 she's freeing prisoners and she now wants to make a reality show of it see that's what i kind of don't like about her but i, I don't like that she's she but regardless of what Kim do, Kim gonna make a coins out of it. That's just what that bitch do. It it don't matter what the fuck this bitch do. This bitch can piss on the side of the sidewalk somewhere. I bet you she gonna sell that piece of sidewalk for about fifty million dollars because it's got a piss. It's got Kim K piss on it. That's what the bitch gonna do. She just makes money. She's that. That's what she fucking does. But I would be bothered. Really, I would only be bothered if the prisoners that she was freeing were all white prisoners. I do appreciate the fact that she is freeing a lot of African American prisoners because majority are uh, uh, are in majority of them are in prison for crimes that they didn't even fucking commit in the first place. So the fact that the bitch is helping them people get out of prison, I I fucks with Kim K because of that. I fucks with her because of that. I appreciate that from her. But does everything have to be a reality TV show though, Kim K? I get that's how you make your money. That's how you was known from from you. Know, on camera i get that but some shit i mean she had been doing it silently this whole time and i mean that's what integrity is kim k doing shit when nobody's watching so just how about you keep moving in silent but then i mean hey kim gotta get her coins i feel her i gotta get my coins too i'm fresh off of work you know what i'm saying but I just don't don't like that she she wants to make a show out of it that's the whole thing but then again being black you freeing our brothers and our sisters and I don't give a damn honestly I don't give a damn free our people and 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 I'm rolling with you on that um, let me think is anything else been going on nothing else really has been going on i just wanted to make a quick video because this is gonna be my new little you know a uh, part of my judge you know we're gonna do car convos i'm gonna try to do car convos at least at least two times a week for sure a little short video where we just talk about what the fuck been going on in the world and things like that um, I might start doing a review on games people play because I just caught up with that show and I ain't gonna lie at first I really wasn't feeling it because I was like oh some BET shit though BET ain't what it used to be back in the day BET used to be black entertainment television now it's just basic entertainment television they took the whole black out of it it's just basic entertainment television but I think I will do a show review on that um, any topics that you guys want to discuss that you guys want to get into drop it down in the comments below let me know remember to like comment subscribe and um, share this video subscribe to my channel I absolutely subscribe back and um, I'll see y'all in the next installment of car combos peace out what's up y'all do me a favor and share the video please make sure to subscribe to my channel let me know what you think and um hit that notification button so you will be up to date when i upload my latest videos i have